good morning. Happy Saturday. I just washed my hair and blew it like partially dry and did the full shower routine. I'm gonna make Scott spray tan me later tonight. So I need to charge my machine. If you didn't watch my um, hygiene routine video, then you probably don't know, but I got one of these like, I worked with this brand called Yo Year, and I really love this. It's really exciting. I'm so excited that Scott's gonna do it to me tonight. Um, Cause I did it to myself last time. It turned out great, but I think it would be even better if someone did it for you. So I'm gonna charge it to make sure it's all charged up and good to go for tonight. Um, so if you haven't seen that video, I'll link it up in the cards, but I figured I would do a little like weekend in my life sort of thing nothing too crazy um but i don't know what we're getting up to really so yeah hi welcome to i haven't filmed a weekend in my life and like a really long time so i figured we would do that why is daddy so drama I don't know, I'm Okay, that's awesome. I got one on my booba too. Yeah. <laughs> I got one too. That's awesome, baby. Yeah, please Yours please. is real though, daddy's is pretend. Yeah, we're making a bigger. Wow. 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 Would you look at that? Would you just look at that? Are you ready to put it in the air fryer? Yeah! Alright, let's do it. Are you ready? I'm ready. It's sunny out, so I figured we'd do our eggs out here, huh? You wanna come out and help me with some eggs? Hopefully you can see me. I have no idea what this looks like. Not doing a wheelie. I tried. I just painted my nails. I did these little like flowers. <laughs> it's my first attempt. I think they turned out okay. They're cutish. Um, my camera's upstairs, so I'm filming on my phone because this one got real messed up. <laughs> We're just gonna ignore her. She's cute still. Um, Earl is napping and he's in a stage where he refuses to like keep the door closed so I have to be very quiet but I think it turned out kind of cute I'm just gonna do it for Easter and then I'll probably remove it before we leave for Florida I'll link the little like things that I used it's like 62 it's such a beautiful day for a little walk come as we go Spray tan, done. Scott did it for me. And now he's making key lime pie. And I'm gonna do some laundry. Marinate in this tan for like two hours. Uh oh, what's that? What's that on the floor? Huh? What's that on the floor? Huh? Put Winnie's dog food in her bowl and then let's follow that trail. Let's follow it. Where does it lead to? Huh? Open it up and see where see what's inside. Open the cabinet and see if there's something in there. Those look like that looks like bunny poop. Does that look like bunny poop? No. Oh. It's just oh, can you open the cabinet? Arlo, can you open the cabinet? 
right here? No, the cabinet, the white thing. Fork. The white thing. Open it up where you get your spoons and forks. Open it. Huh? I don't know. Let's Look, good morning. I'm looking hecka tan because of that spray tan. It always makes my dark spots look darker, I feel like, which is annoying, but what are you going to do? Um, my hands are kind of a flop. Scott, bless his heart. It just wasn't his best work. It's fine. He'll get the hang of it. He's a newbie spray tanner, so... I should have done my own hands, but whatever. Anyways, I just ran to Target. Um, I just wanted to pick up some clear mineral SPFs instead of tinted since that's all I have. So I decided to try two. The Cetaphil Sheer Mineral Face. This is specifically, specifically, I also need water resistant, um, for under makeup. So I got that one, and then I also got the Hydrating CeraVe one for the face as well both fpf 50 and i got some protein chips because i just saw them um anyway today is gonna be a busy day i've got a ton of editing to do and just kind of like catch up work around the house before we leave tomorrow um we had an awesome easter i hope y'all had a great easter nilani's family made our easter like literally so sweet her mom made um our own easter basket and we did this little like chick decorating craft thing and then her dad made the most amazing tomorrow barbecue i hope i'm saying that right and yeah it was a good day and then we watched john rom win the masters so nice relaxing day arlo was just a madman yesterday literally a madman so that was um eventful like he didn't stop the whole day he was just like the energizer buddy so fitting because it's easter you know um but yeah, it's a full day of working and getting things settled before we leave for tomorrow. Um, so I went to a Pilates class this morning to get in one last little sesh. And um, now we're headed home to get to work. But I'm going to vlog this day. So videos will go up like normal while I'm home or while I'm gone to Florida for the week. Um, you'll still have normal vlogs and normal main channel videos I didn't post a vlog yesterday just because it was Easter so and honestly it was good for me since since I would have had to like rush to get something like I don't have enough vlogs anyway you don't care um so yeah let's I'm gonna vlog I think a little bit in Florida like some clips and stuff but not like the whole trip because I'm really gonna try to I'm not bringing my computer I'm not bringing my computer which is like insane I didn't for Mexico either but God, I can't take this tan face seriously. I never really know what's going on. Now let's try this SPF. Two fingers, it feels. I've never had a mineral SPF be this like liquidy really. Okay, it's kind of slightly white, but not too bad. No, it's nice. It's not like a super luminous hydrating finish though. It'll definitely work. Yeah, I'm happy with it. Hopefully it sets nice under my makeup, but I kind of wanted a non-tinted for like, just to have. I'm just like on a sunscreen kick lately, if you couldn't tell. These wrinkles, you were snoring so loud, girlfriend. I was scrubbing my hands trying to get off the freaking self tanner and it is done won't work. For 29 and I find myself wondering, what did happen to the last 10? 
gonna wear tomorrow I might do yeah that'll work so that's what he'll wear on the airplane and then I'm pretty sure I packed maybe I didn't pack his sandals in here so I need to put his sandals in my carry-on um, and a little t-shirt too just for when he gets off and wants just like a t-shirt cuz it's gonna be hot um, I need to pack up all the rest of my jewelry and get my outfit figured out and I need to kind of pack up the rest of this so let's get to it all right, just put in mine and Arlo's last load of laundry. Scott decided to start doing his own laundry and I'm mad at it. He doesn't like dryer sheets and I'm like, I get it, but like I hate static clothes and no matter what I use, I feel like it's still static -y. So let me know what y'all use. I use dryer balls and they still are static -y in my opinion. Anyway, um, we just booked our tickets, Neilani, Steve, Scott, I, and, um, Nilani's sister are going to the Windy City Smoke Out on Saturday, which I'm super excited about. It's Saturday, July, I think 15th or something like that. I don't know, but I'm pumped about it. I haven't been to a concert in like forever. So Scott mentioned it and I didn't know Scott was like a big country fan. He's really not, <laughs> but he's a barbecue fan. So he was like, yeah, let's do it. And I was like, well, he mentioned it to me and I was like, I've heard it a million times. And I've been wanting to do it. So I was stoked that he was down for it. So we, and then I didn't realize Nilani liked country music either. So we were like, let's all just go. It'll be a great time. So that's what we're doing and I'm pretty excited about it. So that's the plan for that. And I'm gonna go through and I'm waiting for the light to get better in this office before I film my two videos. Oh yeah, we got crayons, cool. And um, then film two videos, two pull-ups. I'm probably gonna put him in a pull-up for the airplane, just in case. Um, just a couple more in there. But I need an extra change of clothes and stuff. But anyway, I just wanted to let you know I'm excited about the Windy City smoke out. Okay, there's some fruit bars, raisins, we'll be good. We're probably gonna get breakfast at the airport before we leave and then um, get lunch when we arrive. Figured it would be the best bet. So probably not too many snacks. Pockets are good, let me just double check. Carlo didn't stick any like knives in here. So tackle me at security. Okay. Grab an extra change of clothes and a couple more weights. Also, one of my contenders for my Kentucky Derby little hat showed up. You can either wear it as like a headband or you can like clip it in your hair. Like such, how do I look? And our little bow tie came in. So, yeah, cute. Ow, ow, ow. Um, so, put that to the side. And I need to finish packing my suitcase. This is a like 
whatever is left in the fridge sort of lunch. Um, we didn't have meat, so I have chicken nuggets, air fried, hot sauce, some rice, and a bag of butter lettuce. I also cleaned out my fridge. I hate leaving food in the fridge when we leave because it's so gross. Even though we're not going to be gone that long, I just don't want to do it. So let's eat <laughs> this non-appetizing <laughs> lunch, shall we? This one he's eating the fruit loops that <laughs> oh my quarter! Why did I need that? That Nailani's mom gave Arlo oh, on the way home. But it's officially the saddest time of leaving. Oh shoot! Hey, really? Okay. There's always a package by me. Okay. Let's go drop Miss Wrinkles off at Miss Kimberly's. All packed up. It's six, six o'clock. Um, I have been, I thought I was gonna be able to like film and like do some stuff with y'all tonight, but that just didn't happen. I might have to combine some vlogs and y'all might have to be without a vlog. Make me sad, but it might be, ooh, girl, the truth because it's just kind of been, a much heavier editing day than I thought it was gonna be, but that's okay. Um, and I thought I was gonna cook dinner tonight with some leftover ground turkey that I had in the fridge, but I was like, mm, nope. I'm just gonna make up sweet cream. Cause I don't feel like cleaning and doing all that. So we're just gonna make it easy and, do I have my phone? Yeah, okay. I know where I'm going anyways, but I figure we'll just make it easy and I'll just grab Swick rings on the way back. So that way we get one last healthy meal in and um, I don't have to cook and dirty up a bunch of dishes because we still have, Scott has not packed. I still have some packing to do and I like to tidy up the house a little bit before we leave. So yeah, I like, don't know how this day got ahead of, or got away from me, but Miss Renly's, I'm gonna mess me. I'm gonna miss you, Chicken Lee. I'm gonna miss you, chickens. Oh, it's fur's coming out of you. Oh, so I should have brushed you again, huh? So, 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 darn it. it is so sunny. It is 70 degrees out. I'm in a t-shirt. It's so nice out. I'm like, what the heck? I don't even need to leave to Florida right now because it's still warm. It's so warm right now. Um, but of course, it's probably gonna be cold when we get back, but. I think it's supposed to be the same temperature here as it is in Florida. I think they're getting a little bit of a cold front. Go figure. I mean, 80 degrees is not a cold front for us. It's perfection, but you know what I mean. What y'all's go to order at Sweet Green? I think I've only ever ordered the crispy rice bowl. It's just my favorite, and it sounds the best every time I like go to order. So I just always order it, and I'm ordering it for Scott. And then I like the little chicken that they do for Arlo. <gasps> oh, I'm so happy that they have a sweet green over here because it's just like a quick and healthy, like easy meal situation that um, I feel like they didn't have before. Hush, Renlish. Honestly though, y'all, like I'm almost tempted to like book her, a free, her flight for Christmas her flight was the same price as what it was to board her. Like, like if I were to buy her a seat on the dang airplane, it was the same price as it was to board her. Boarding your dog is not cheap, especially if it's at someone's house, but it's so much more worth it than at like a giant kennel. When I tell you that this lady takes better care of Miss Wrinkles, I swear. Oh, Miss Wrinkles. She's like, I've got more food to scope out back here. I gotta see if I ate all Arlo's snacks. At least he drops stuff for her. Cause I always wonder if she's like, what the heck is my life? I did not sign up for this little monster to be in here. But um, oh, everyone's sitting out on the patio having a beer. Oh, I'm just so ready to have some grouper in Florida. All the fish tacos, all the seafood. Give to me, I'm here for it. Order sweet green real quick on our way home. Okay. All right, let's go grab some dinner and 
get ourselves ready for for Florida. Even though I don't even care to leave, it's literally 73 degrees here. Back. I love it. Spring is sprung. Like people's tulips are blooming. Oh, I'm obsessed. Miss Winnie gets so excited when we're like in this neighborhood. She like knows where we're going, and like that is just there's truly zero better feeling than like having your dog like where they stay. Cause normally like she'll like cry or like try to scratch at the door if I leave her. She just like moseys on in the house. She knows where she's going. Like she's good. So I feel like I've I've used her what? How many times have I used her now? Christmas? I've used her last September, December, oh, not this one, um, February, and now here. So yeah, I've used her a lot. She's freaking amazing. Um, I, uh, yeah, yes, let's go, let's go. I like this area too. She lives in um, Elk Grove. It's like some really cute little like suburby houses. But let's go pick up our sweet green. Let's go get our packing done. And then we're off. I'm excited to see my daddy o and um, have a little walk down memory lane this next or this week because I haven't been to Florida in way too long. Am I gonna miss it? Will I get all those feels? <laughs> Something tells me I probably won't, but I could be wrong. I don't know. Not that I'm hating on Florida, I loved Florida for as long as I lived there, but. To me, I was watching this random girl on TikTok the other day talk about like where do people go out in Tampa and so on and so forth. Like to me, just college is just, or Tampa is just such a college town because that's where I went to college. So like, I'm like, McDids? <laughs> like, um, I can't even think of the other one that we would go to, McDids. Why can I not think of the other one that's next to the railroad tracks? But like, it's just, I don't know, like happy hours, like yard house. Like, just places that you can get really, really cheap drinks. What was the place that used to be across from American Airlines? Or the, yeah, is it American Airlines? Amelie Arena. Amelia? I don't know. Down in Channel Side, that was like this small little bar and you used to get dollar pitchers. It closed down way before I even um, graduated. And then they also used to have this place which changed names so many times called Study Hall. It was like down Howard, I want to, not Howard, oh my God, names. It was right next, you could walk from school, like back when I was in the dorms, and then it became monkey, monkey room, monkey club, monkey, I don't know. But I'm like, I was trying to find places to go for like a nice dinner or something, and I, there's this girl I follow on Instagram, her name's Sweet Tea with Maddie, and she, moved there recently and she's got that like same sort of like she's in her 30s or maybe she's 30 so she like posts a lot of good things so I'm probably gonna take some of her suggestions because I'm like I wasn't eating fancy nice dinners when I was in college I was trying to find the cheapest all you could drink happy hour you know <laughs> priorities were different back then but I'm sure there's so much good food in Tampa um I would like to go. I mean, Oxford Exchange, I feel like that's like a standard classic. I think Scott would like that location. It's really pretty of what I remember anyways. I love the dining area of it being like a tea thing. Ugh, I have like dog hair on my face because I let Winnie stick her head out the window and her hair was flying everywhere because she was, uh, she's so fluffy and soft and she needed another brush in, but anyway. We're here. Cured the goods. Let's go home and chow down.